Well, that's excellent news. I just called the club. Everything's going smoothly. You know what that means, don't you? Well, what does that mean? That's the last piece of business I'm going to do, so I'm going to take my two favorite ladies to lunch and then perhaps to a movie. Oh, I, I don't think so. Oh, why not? Come on, let's have a family day. Robin's at the afternoon, aren't doesn't she? Um, yeah, but, uh, well, she says she's got some other plans. Excuse me? Um, she, uh, she said she had other plans and, uh, that I was to, to give this doll to another little girl. Well, to give this doll? Mm -hmm. This is her favourite doll, isn't it? Mm. She, she said that big girls don't play with dolls. Oh. What are these big girl plans she has, you know? No, um, she needs to see her father. Why? You know? No, I don't know. I don't know. I just hope that he can handle it. You know, he's had coffee on his mind a lot these days. Good morning. Oh, Mary, I'm Hey, Sally's my little baby. Oh, please don't call me that. I'm not a baby. Sorry. Oh, hello, Robin. Hi, Catherine. Thank you so much for agreeing to meet me. Chum, don't look at me like that. It's her call. Uh -huh. You can go now. I think I could take it from you. Oh, yes, ma'am. Hey, Kamish, will you deliver her home safe and sound? I'm not due till later. You bet. Okay, I'm going to split, kiddo. Okay. Hey, ma'am. I am not want to walk in your moccasins today. Good luck. This thing came on all of a sudden. Hmm. Well, now, can I get you something? Oh, no, thank you. No soda, no ice cream, no donuts, none of that rubbish? That stuff is fat. <laughs> well, if you change your mind. <laughs> well, suppose you tell us what's going on, hmm? I suppose that you want to know what this is all about. Yeah, I guess you could say that. Yeah, I'm curious, yes. You're not sick, are you, hmm? Oh, no, but if this doesn't work, I will be. What doesn't work? See, I have this problem. No. Uh -huh. And I didn't want to bother Mommy or Uncle Duke about it, because they've had, you know, so much on their mind lately about the trial and everything. Well, I think that's very thoughtful of you. That's why I wanted to discuss it with you two. Oh, thanks. I'm, I'm flattered. Well, look, now that you're taking us into your confidence, what's the problem? My hair. Your hair? Yes. It's gross, and worse than that, it's straight. Well, I have straight hair. What's the matter with that? Well, I hate it, and boys hate it. That's why I want to get a permanent. Boys like girls with curly hair. Uh, what? Where did you I get that idea? That's a great idea. Uh, what? I knew you'd understand. As a matter of fact, uh, I have this wonderful hairdresser. You got really it. What, what? Well, but first, we have to ask your mother. Oh, I know she's going to say no. No, no, wait. Yeah, right. And if you want my opinion well, on this... Well, she doesn't want I... your opinion. Now, if you ask her really nicely, I'm sure she won't. Will you talk to her for me? Oh, I'll give it... I'll give it a shot. Can I have a quarter, please? Yeah, sure. Now, look, what are you going to do here? Oh, well, not me. Us. We are going to solve Robin's problem. Thank, Thank you. you. Now, you just wait here and I'll try and handle this one. Okay. <clears throat> I don't see anything wrong with your hair. Daddy, can't do anything with it. Oh. Anna, hello, this is Catherine Delafield. Hi, how are you? Oh, I'm fine. I'm, I'm here with Robin and Robert. Is, is she all right? Oh, yes, yes. Um, we're just discussing her problem. It seems that she really hates her hair and, and she wants a perm. A what? What's the matter? Robin's hair. Uh, What's wrong with her hair? She, ha she hates it. She, um, well, I mean... If she hates it that much, does she... No, I think hate is too weak a word here. Well, I don't know. I mean, um... I can't... I, uh, well, I'll, I'll speak to my hairdresser. Maybe I'll take her over there. May I make a suggestion here? I, if I could take her to my hairdresser this morning. Oh, well. What time would I meet you? And where, where is it? Uh, uh don't think me intruding too much here, but if I could make another little suggestion. Oh, um, she wants it to be a surprise. Yeah, she wants to handle it all by her 11-year-old self. Without her mom. Um, okay, uh, right, uh, 
I, I can't say that I really like it, but if, if that's what she wants to do, then, then let her do that. Well, I'll tell her. She will be really thrilled. She really wants to surprise you. Well, we'll see you later then, okay? Okay, bye. Okay. Oh, yes, you said yes. All right, uh, your car or mine? <clears throat> well, since you've done so much this morning, I feel compelled to drive. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Here we go. New hair, here, here we, we go. go. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. I don't know why I'm so surprised. I mean, it's, it'll just happen anyway, right? What is it? What's going on? Um, it's just my little girl's growing up, and... She wants the ham. Come on, is that all? It's nothing to get upset about, is it? I know, I don't know why I feel like this. I just... Well, uh, uh, do me a favor, look at me. Yeah. No tears today. If we're going to go out and people see you've been crying, then they're just going to assume I've done something to upset you. I, I don't want to find out. Oh, well, in that case, neither do I. How long does it take to perm a little head? A while. No more times I'll lend you back? Uh, later. So that leaves you and I here alone to enjoy the house. Come on, I don't even want to talk about that. Come on, sit down. That's all you have to do is just sit here and relax and let me make it happen. Why they say happy birthday. Happy birthday. I should go get some candles like I'm saying happy birthday. Do you want me to do that? No. Oh, I don't know. I wouldn't eat the sandwiches if I were you. They taste like Robin made them. <laughs> oh, they're not peanut butter and sardines, are they? Yes, they are. <laughs> 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 this reminds me, you know, remember when, when you were trying to catch the fish through the ice and then you went through the ice? Reminds me of that. Oh, thanks. What are you trying to do? Make me cry then? We just ruined this whole day. No, I'm not trying to make you cry. This isn't peanut butter. What is it? It isn't peanut butter? What is it? Well, I don't know. Well, what you don't know won't hurt you, I suppose. Tell me what it is. Tell me what it is. Don't you tell me. Tell me what it is. Tell me what it is. Tell me what's in the sandwich. What's in it? What's in it? I don't know what's in the sandwich. Look, I'll have to make more sandwiches now. That's all right. I quite like your cooking anyway. No. I love you. Okay. That's all today's for then. Mm -hmm. Loving, laughing, and mystery sandwiches. <laughs> What's in that sandwich? I'm not telling you. I don't know. Oh. When do you have to leave? I don't want to talk about it. Good things will happen. Good things will happen to us. Look, today we're having these good things happening right now. We spent half the morning talking about good things. Bad things will happen though, too. I know, but we overcame them. That wasn't that bad. Come on, we're fine. We're together. We're stronger than ever. Even the trial won't stop us. You'll what's going to happen after the trial? Uh, we're going to be fine after the trial. Doesn't matter what the mob or what the government throw me, we're going to be perfectly all right. It's going to be you, me, and Robin. We'll be fine. Gotta believe it. Sometimes I believe that uh, nothing bad will ever happen to us. Nothing. And then sometimes I just. I mean, let's face it, how long could it possibly take to oh, stick some uh, some rollers in a little person's head? It's not a very big head. Oh, just be patient, come on. I mean, do you know how long I've been standing here doing this? Well, you know what they say, at what price, beauty. And let's talk about that, too, the price of this thing. I mean... <laughs> Don't be such a grouch. Come yeah. on, she'll be out any minute now, so All right. prepare yourself. All right, I'm sorry. Good. All right. Uh-oh, no, turn around. Close your eyes. Come on, just no, do no, it. I feel such an idiot. No, I'm the police no, no. commissioner. You know, I'm standing on the street with my no, eyes no, closed. I'm not wonderful. Daddy? Mm hmm You can turn around now. Well, I'm about time to... Where'd she go? What? 
As I recall, I brought along a young daughter of mine who disappeared into that shop, and instead I have standing before me this rather young, beautiful, sophisticated young lady. You really like it? Hmm. I love it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> You know, it's going to take a little bit of getting used to, but I'll tell you this. What? It's going to be a big hit with the guys. I mean, all those curls and things. I uh, <laughs> don't know how I'm going to deal with that. But listen, why don't you wait here, and I'll go get the car. Okay. Right? Oh, I almost forgot. Do you have $5? Yeah, why? Well, Catherine said I should tip the man. <clears throat> Five dollars, huh? Yep. Thank you. Easy come, easy go. <laughs> You're the one that should be getting the tip. No, no, I had a great time, I did. You know, you were really wonderful just then. You know, yeah. I know it can be a jolt to Daddy. Yeah. Daddy was jolted, all right. Yeah, he didn't realize how fast you'd grown up. Mm. Incidentally, you weren't... Uh, you weren't so bad yourself. I... I want to thank you. Mm. You just... No, 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 no. I mean, well, I messed up your breakfast this morning. That's only fair that I'd buy you lunch. Oh, you don't have to do that. Yeah, but, you know, I'd like to. You made a little girl and her father extremely happy. Well, the least you can do is let me feed you, eh? Yeah. So what say we, uh... No, I'd really love to, but I, I have to go to the cottage and practice. This... Um, okay, how about dinner? That little inn, just just by the cottage. Really, I right. love that. Yeah, that's but it. This I is your big chance. Oh, right, no, right. No, eight o'clock. Okay. okay, I'll be ready. Good. Right, I'm ready. I'll put on makeup. Right. I look great. The yeah. man said thank you. Good. Listen, you wait here. I shall find the car. Okay. Don't want to mess up all those curls, right? Isn't it lovely. <laughs> Catherine. Right. Thanks. Thank you, man. Thank you. <laughs> You look so beautiful. I cannot believe how beautiful you look. What do you think, Anna? Mommy? Give her a chance. She has to adjust to the new you. Oh, I'm still the same. It's just that my hair's different. No, you, you, you're all different. You're all grown up. But you do look beautiful. Yeah. You like it? One day when you have a little girl, you'll understand how I feel, but... You're not too grown up to give me a hug, are you? Come on. Hey, easy with the hair. Oh, you know, it costs me a bun. Oh, you like it, Mommy? I do. I really like it. Really you know, I think the boys are going to be beating down the door. You think so? I don't think so. I know so. And all your little friends at school will be so jealous they'll be pulling their own hair out. You'll see. My friends didn't think that I'd do it. But she did. Better go call them right now. Thank you for bringing me, Daddy. You're welcome. And say thanks to Catherine, too. Mm-hmm. And thank you, Mommy, for saying it's okay. Uh -huh. And thank you, Duke, for saying I look good. I didn't say you look good. I said you look beautiful. Well, thank you. There's a big difference. You're very welcome. Hmm. You want to say something? I'm, I'm just in shock. I'm in shock. Yeah, I know the feeling. I mean, our little baby's all grown up. No, yeah, she's grown up, but you could both be very proud of the way she has grown up. Thank you. She's rather concerned about the bug of you. You okay? Yeah. Yeah, well, as long as we don't talk about the trial, we're all right. No, we just don't talk about it. No. Do you have anything new on the investigation? Not yet. Oh, yeah. Uh, Paul. Paul's of all called here for Catherine, so maybe you ought to give her that message. I don't think I really want to get into that, but I'll convey the message. Anyway. I'll see you out. Thank you. Bye. You got a lot of homework? No. Nope. Well, please don't say I have to go to bed. Now that I'm growing up, I don't have to go to bed so early, do I? Oh. I just... Well, you know, I, I really wish you weren't in such a hurry to grow up. Well, I really want to grow up like you two, so I can do whatever I want. Wear my hair a certain way, or wear what I want, or well, live what I want. My Being grown up isn't as easy as you think, okay? Okay. Oh, you can say that again. In fact, you two have given me a major problem tonight. I don't know who is the most beautiful. Mom. Robin. Oh, thank you. You're a great help. <laughs> <laughs>
I'm glad you guys aren't mad at me. I would have told you what I was going to do, but I figured you'd have enough problems right now. I had to solve this on my own. Well, we're very proud of you for doing it that way. It's very grown up. Thank you. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> when I was driving around Port Charles this afternoon, I was feeling so lucky to live here with you guys and Daddy too. What's the matter? Nothing. Oh, nothing. I, um, uh, you should write a thank you letter to Catherine. You should do that. I definitely will. And Daddy's going to say thank you again to her anyways. Mm -hmm. He's taking her out to dinner tonight. Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Your source of information, right? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, get ready for bed now.